In Blackboard, you can use adaptive release to limit access to any content item or folder within your Blackboard course. So here, I'm going to limit access to this folder and obviously everything inside it by adding an adaptive release rule. And the adaptive release rule that I'm going to create will be based upon particular allowing particular uh, students who are enrolled in the course to see it. So I'm going to create a rule called members. And the rule that I'm going to create, the criteria, is based upon membership, which allows me to select individuals, or if you've set up groups already, you can choose a group so that all users or students within the group would have access to the folder. So here, clicking on browse, I can search for users that contain or is equal or not blank. So simply I'm going to choose not blank and that will give me a list of all the users in the course. And I'm just going to choose this student user, my preview user, to uh, for testing the system. So this means I'm going to allow the preview user access to this folder. Hit submit. So now when we go back to term one, there is an adaptive release rule on this, which means only the preview user can see this, fo this folder. So if I go into the student preview and click on term one, the folder is, a visible, is visible. If I change the rule, so if I go back here and I go back to term one and click on uh, adaptive release advance, and I'm going to edit the membership rule, the criteria, and here, the edit the members here. So at the moment, I'm going to delete the preview user that's here. And I'm just going to simply add. So again, I'm going to go through the process and go to non-blank. And I'm just going to add the other user here. So now, the rule will not include the preview user. So when we hit submit, we still have one user having access to this. And obviously for you uh, using it with an actual group of students, you can set up a rule based on membership and choose all the students you want to have access to the folder. And you can also set other criteria such as a grade that only students with a certain grade would have access or a particular date. So here, let's see by going to my student preview. If I click on term one, we shouldn't see the folder. And indeed, it's not here because the adaptive release rule says that it's not available. So this is a quick way for content, be it folders or individual items, anything that you can apply adaptive release to, to be available only to those who meet the criteria. And we've seen how to do the membership criteria here. That's it.